How you doing, good people? We got a special, special video for you today. We'll be interviewing seven-year-old Pokemon collector, Abel Chapman. Now, Abel is what you will consider to be a expert Pokemon collector. He taught me a lot in this interview. And the cool thing is you get a chance to see the relationship that he has with his father and how his father inspired his collecting. Now, if you follow We Up Now Gaming, then you know our mission is to increase the amount of minorities in the gaming industry. Now, one important aspect of the gaming industry is content creation. So congratulations, Abel. You are officially a content creator. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please don't laugh at me. It was my first time talking Pokemon since the series came out back in 1997. <laughs> but you know the vibes. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please don't laugh. It was my first time talking Pokemon since the series came out back in 1997. Jeez. <laughs> but you know the vibes. Anytime your goals become the new standard, the only direction is up. We up now, baby. How you doing, good people? How you doing, Chapman family? How y'all doing What's tonight? Up? What's up? Doing good, man. Hey, mm -hmm. before we get started, man, I hope everybody out there is safe. We got a special, special event for you tonight. We got a Pokemon collector, young Abel. He'll be showing us his collection. So we're very, very excited for him to show us what he got. And I know for me, I'll be honest with you, Abel, I haven't watched Pokemon since I was your age. When I was watching Pokemon, they were, they were still, uh, what was it, Team Rocket? They were still trying to catch Pikachu, man. So I don't know if that's still a thing or not. But uh, I'm talking about first season, man. <laughs> I remember when it came out. But uh, I'm, I'm definitely excited about this. And I know Pokemon, it has its own community. So I know it's a lot of people out there that's excited about it. Uh, so with that being said, I just want to get a chance to uh, take, take some time to uh, learn a little bit about uh, Abel and the Chapman family and which, what got you into collecting Pokemon cards. I'd probably say... All the legendaries and big cards and all that stuff. Okay. How long has Abel been collecting and, and what are your thoughts on what got him into it? Uh yeah, so I mean, um I start I was collecting Pokemon cards since I was a kid, honestly. So it was something that I was always into. Even as an adult I still sometimes dive into the game. It's a really fun concept. Um in like I think I was watching, like, uh, had a piece of nostalgia happen, you know. I was watching it one day, and he just, I seen his eyes glow up. And I think he was maybe like three or four. And we started buying him little, uh, you know, action figures, little Pokemon action figures. When I seen him start to like that, you know, we dove into the cards a little bit more, you know. We had some mishaps, you know. Like, um, he had, uh, he went to school one time. Older kids kind of tricked him into, you know trading it, uh, his good cards for their bad cards. Oh, man. So we, yeah, so we held off for a little bit, but now that he's a little older, a little more mature, he, he handles it much more, much better, so. Oh, that's perfect, man. We can't, we can't yeah. allow that to happen. So, Abel, what's your, what's your favorite Pokemon? Uh, Dialga. Dialga. Okay, so, Abel, that's one that I don't know. I don't know what it is, what it looked like, so can you show me a photo. Oh, you got. Okay, turn it to the side a little bit so I can see the profile. Okay, Dialga. What is his specialty? Uh, oh, it's a deity in the Sinnoh region. Uh, it's can control time with its roar. Oh. Uh, and I have it in Pokemon Brilliant Diamond. Oh, nice. If if you were a Pokemon, what kind of Pokemon would you be? Huh. I'd probably say Zerud. Zerud. Zerud? Zerud, like. Yeah, I need to see oh, that too. <laughs> <laughs> this guy. Nice. He can swing he can swing from tree to tree with 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 the vines that are wrapped around his wrist. Mm. Okay. 
So, so you would like to swing from trees. <laughs> yeah. Now, Abel, does, does it make me old that my favorite Pokemon is still Pikachu? Yeah. Nah. I like you too. Yeah. <laughs> I, I just feel like... A lot of these in my collection. You say you got a lot of them in your collection? Yes, I do. Yeah, that's, that's the one that's the most well-known. Yeah, Pikachu, that's my guy. I ain't gonna lie, he a little feisty critter. <laughs> yeah, light you up too. <laughs> Don't feel bad, B. I'm in the same boat. I know the, the, the hundred. Yeah, I know the hundred and fifty. They up to like, I want to say thousands now. You know, oh. <laughs> it was hard to keep track. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think it was like twenty back when I was watching. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> I got agent in the chat. He said we up now. Ava's favorite is Pikachu. Oh, Pichu is that? Is that different than Pikachu, agent? Uh it, it's the first stage of the of Pikachu's evolution. It's from Pichu to Pikachu to Raichu. Well, depending on what region. If it's in the Alolan region, it'll evolve into a Lol into a Lolan Raichu. Alright, Abel, well you put me on game now. So you mean to tell me that Pikachu has different phases? Yeah. Almost all Pokemon do. I, so did, I, didn't, I didn't know that. So, so they evolved, basically. Yeah. Why has Pikachu been the same all these years? When is he going to evolve? <laughs> yeah. Um. She's, like, if you're talking about Ash, Ash's Pikachu, he doesn't really like to evolve. So he, so he tries to avoid leveling up so he doesn't evolve oh so he does that on purpose yeah is that because ash just loves him where he is yeah i'd say that it's either that or he just doesn't want to become right too okay so you know this so you know all of like the evolutions the first stages the second stages the most powerful stage you, you know all of this stuff huh not all of it. There's some stuff I don't know. There's uh, some Pokemon I'm trying to research. Anafi, and there's another one. You're doing your They're research. They're like water like Pokemon. Doing your research. I like that. So would you consider yourself uh, like a Pokemon trainer? Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And you, you got the you got the ball, you got the belt, the whole nine, right? Yeah. Yeah, let's let's see it. Let's show the people show the people what you got. Put some Pokeballs in here. Oh <laughs> Premier um in Pokemon uh I know the the Premier Ball was used to celebrate a catching event of some sort. Yeah. Okay. And that's pretty cool, man. So let's get into your collection, because apparently you got a, a pretty exclusive collection, and I'm, I'm I can't wait to yeah. see it. You want to show them the big cards first? Yeah. Okay. I got fourteen big cards. Okay. So you seen the Pikachu? Then we have this guy. Who is that guy? Oh, uh, Dragapult. Okay. We have another one of him. He's a VMAX. So tell me what a VMAX is. A VMAX? Well, it's like the Gigantamax in Pokemon card form or Dynamax. Okay. Um... We've got double street sent me this. Who sent you that? Streets. Remember? Streets the Pokemon? Yeah. yeah. Is I mean, Streets the Pokemon Connect I need to talk to? Yeah, yeah. He he's he's tough out here. Yeah. <laughs> He's, he's talking about, I'll, I'll put y'all in touch. Yeah, because I mean, listen, man, this is, uh, apparently this is big business, and you know, Fox like big business now. <laughs> yeah, he's, he's heavy. He's yeah, heavy. yeah, we need to talk. He sends me guys all the time. Yeah, he hooks Abel up. <laughs> That's what's up. 
So, so, so can I just go to the store and buy an exclusive yeah, card? Like, can I go to Target um, tomorrow and just start collecting cards? Is that how it works? So I need to know somebody that knows somebody that knows somebody. No, um, you could you could go and buy and buy packs is what we do the majority of the time is just go buy packs, and they'll release special V Max packs with you know where you know what kind of card is going to be and it kind of be like you know right on the forefront of the box type thing. You'll know exactly what card, what's the big card you're getting, but okay. you won't know the rest of the card. Yeah, yeah, cause like, cause like in a pack, like, like a big card pack. You can see the big card, but you can't see all the other cards. Gotcha. If you can, like, see the tiny pack, you won't be able to see, like, the Pokemon cards in it. So, and if you went and got these packs, B, uh, it's, a, it's a scale. So, if a card has a circle on it, mm -hmm. uh, at the bottom where you were saying the star was, if it has a circle on it, it's common. If it has a diamond on it, it's uncommon. If it has a regular star on it, it's a keeper, but it has a white star on it. They seal it away. And make it do. Yeah, cause so. it's that's like super like, rare. Yeah, that's like a super rare. Got two of those right here. Okay, I got a little. I got, I got my little buddy done came down. You gonna say hi to the people? Hey, come in. Say hi to everybody. Say hi, everybody. Hi. Oh yeah. Say hi to. Hey. <laughs> say hey. Hey, we up now, baby. <laughs> so this 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 actually looked to me like a, a father and son pastime right here. Oh, for sure, oh for sure. Yeah. I love you know, to watch. <laughs> I, get, I get just as excited as he do when I see a good car, you know. Nah, and, that's and dope. It's all it's also good because you give him a little bit of a advantage because I know a little bit. Yeah, know more about the old school Pokemon, you know. So Ace did that, so hopefully you ain't had to go through that. Here, Rainbow GX, Rainbow GX, Sogaleo. Now, now, Abel, I know you enjoy collecting Pokemon, but this isn't the only thing you love to do, right? What are What are some of the other things that you like to do with your spare time? Oh, uh. Well, mostly I watch movies when I'm not. I don't like have my Pokemon out or stuff like that. Okay, what's your favorite movie? Hmm, one's gone wrong. It's super silly. What is it? One's gone wrong. It's on. It's on Disney Plus. I gotta um, check that out. What about any yeah. sports? You like any sports? Uh, I like wrestling. Yeah. Hey, I, I seen like I seen a video of you recently. You're pretty good at wrestling. Yeah, focusing on trying to be quick and getting the leg stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. your your father was a good wrestler too. What you did wrestling? <laughs> <laughs> I just seen him wrestle a few people. Was, I know my mom played. <laughs> it, was off the, it was off the record wrestling. <laughs> what? what do you mean off the record? We're talking Let's about that later, Abel. <laughs> Is it like a legal wrestling or something? <laughs> Let's talk about Pokemon. <laughs> so, Abel, the most important question of the night. How are those grades? How are you doing in school? Uh, good. There's good? Some stuff i'm trying to figure out still okay and, uh, otherwise i'm doing pretty good it's always good so, to have something to work for uh the boy had all a's b he the low, humble, I think humble his able man i tell you yeah, <laughs> i think his lowest grade was a 98 wow. Yeah, wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. like uh, wow able <laughs> especially in math like, like when we're doing on your own math I'm usually one of the first ones. Like all the like all I need to figure out a math problem. Time to think pencil and an eraser. That's all I need. <laughs> so Abel, I'm I'm like I appreciate you educate me on the Pokemon. Uh I'm excited to see where you go in your collection. It's already exclusive and I'm pretty sure you're gonna keep collecting. So 
before we leave tonight, I got some trivia for you because now I'm seeing I'm interested in seeing how much you really know. All right. All right. So let's let's get into it. Abel. First question is uh, the lovable team rocket have been trying to catch Ash's Pikachu for decades. What are, what are their names? A. Jesse and James. B. Johnny and James. C. Jenny and James. Or D. Jesse and Jim Bob. Uh, A. A. Jesse and James. Uh, but D was really funny. <laughs> <laughs> Jim Bob. There's actually um uh, somebody in Sneaky Sasquatch can't remember their name. Had Jim Bob in it. Had uh, Jim, oh, Jim Bob in it. Jim Bob. His name was Old Jim Bob. <laughs> so the next question is: the new series of Pokemon, Pokemon Journeys, introduces a new companion to Ash. What is his name? Joe, Tro, Do, or Go? Go. Answer oh. is go. Good job. Yeah. All right. Next question. The first so legendary, cool. the first legendary Pokemon introduced in Kanto region are. <laughs> you might have to help me with these names: Articuno, Zapdos, Articuno. Zapdos, and. It's Articuno. Oh, see Articuno. Is Zapdos? Am I saying that right? Yeah, Zapdos. Okay. And the last one is A, Mew, B, Lugia, C, Victina, D, Vic Moltres. Vic Moltres. Which one? Moltres. Did you repeat the question? I don't think he caught the question. Okay. So the first legendary Pokemon introduced in the, in the Kanto region are Articuno, Zapdos, and A, Mew, B, Lugia, C, Victina, and, or D, Moltres? Moltres. Yep, Dang. that's correct. <laughs> and also for uh, Lugia, it's actually pronounced Lugia, and for Victina, it's Victini. I appreciate it. <laughs> I appreciate it. I'm just trying to help you learn the name. <laughs> hey, listen, man. I'm, I'm learning. I'm learning. I'm learning a lot tonight. All right, next question. Which Pokemon is cheerfully described like this in the Pokédex? It pines for the mother it will never see again. Seeing a likeness of its mother in the full moon, it cries. The stains of the skull the Pokemon wears are made by the tears of shed. Tears it shed. Cubone. Oh, that, that was so easy. I couldn't even read it, Abel. And you telling me how easy it was to answer it. So that just lets you know we on different levels, Abel. I'm like, I'm like at the whatever is below beginner. That's where you can find me. Yeah. <laughs> All right, next. My friends call me a Pokemon nerd. There's nothing wrong with, there's nothing wrong with that. All right, next. Uh, totally pathetic, unreliable, known throughout the world for being super weak. The famous opening lyrics to the Magikarp song. But how many candy do you need to evolve a, Mar a Magikarp into Diardos in Pokemon Go? Gyarados. Yeah, yep. 25, 50, 100, or 400? Uh, uh oh, we might have them, people. Yeah, I, I think I'm stumped on this one. Take a guess. You, you want to phone a friend? Yeah. <laughs> Let me hear the choices 25, 50, 100, or 400. I'll say 25. 25? Ah, uh, it's 400. Uh. Really? Oh, that's interesting, man. That's, Dang, a, that's, that's a high blood. level, right? You just you taught me something because usually you can't um you can't evolve a magic cart without using the water stone, so that must be something new. Um, hey, listen, but yeah. 
Yeah, yeah. I, I'm still I on Pikachu. All right. You know something I don't. I'm still. I, I, this is not me. I promise you, it's not. I found these questions online. I'm still on Pikachu. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got a couple of more. All right. In the episode in in the episode one journey ends, another begins. Litton's Pokémon friend passes away. What is what was his name? Lillipup, Erdier, Southland, or Inti? Uh Hmm, let me think on this one. I'm gonna... Wait, wait, wait. What was the first one? Lillipup, Erdier, Southland, or Inti? Inti, I might be saying that wrong. Inte. Inte, yeah. So in the episode, Ooh. in the episode, one journey ends, another oh. begins. Litton's Pokemon friend passes away. What was his name? Last that one? You want to take a guess? I just did. Which one? That one. That's correct. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. Good job. All right. That was a hard one. That was, that was, was pretty hard. All right, the last question. The Pokemon anime series has focused on the adventures of Ash since his debut in 1997, back when I was watching. All right. <laughs> but what was Ash's sur surname? Huh? Hachim, Catchum, Etchum, or Ketchup? Surname means your last name. What's his last name? Hachim? Catch him? Yeah. That's correct. Oh my god! <laughs> Good job, <What>? man. <laughs> Congratulations. I think you scored just as high on that as you, you're doing in school right now. Good job. <laughs> yeah. So so let's talk let's talk to Ace a little bit. What's up? Papa Bear. What's up, brother? So so you know, obviously, it's, it's, it's obvious that you support uh, Abel and his collection. Um, and it's, it sounds like it's something that you were, were into at first, and then you pass it on to him. So, so what's next? Like, what, what do you think uh, the future holds with uh, Ace, A Abel's collection? Oh, uh, man, honestly, we're just going to keep, keep collecting, try to stay, you know, up to date on what's going on out here, uh, what cards are, you know. Because, you know, it's like anything else. What's hot right now may not be hot tomorrow, you know. Fat Joe say today's price is tomorrow's price. I, you, say, <laughs> you know what I mean? But um, just stay relevant, you know, stay up to date with it and just try to keep getting cards and look for those those rare ones, man, that may pay dividends later on, you know. Yeah, because like I said, you never know. And especially with the whole generation that's growing up and Pokemon is a pivotal part of their life. As I would say probably the most popular anime series it was it was absolutely the first anime series that i ever watched and i got a little bit into dragon ball z uh but, that's probably yeah. the other one he watching that as well that's just yeah <laughs> like dragon ball z from time to time yeah. dad dad watches a lot once saw uh, um like a dragon ball z movie being like on his like tablet up here yeah. Yeah. i love it man Dylan. Frieza, I think. Mm -hmm. I love it. I love it. So, so Abel, we want to make sure that we send over something to you. So you'll be getting something in the mail pretty soon from Mommy Milk Bar and We Up Now Gaming because we want to support your collection. We want to make sure uh, that this is something that you can continue to do because it's always important to have hobbies uh, that you can invest in and put your time and your energy into. Uh, especially something that may pay off in the long run. So we want to make sure that we su we support that. All right, and as long as you keep getting getting good grades, then you're gonna have a lot of people that's that's willing to support you. Okay. Okay. Yeah, thanks. Well, we thank you for for uh, showing us your collection today. This is 
this was fun. This is the first time we up now game and has ever did anything like this. So we we're excited. We're excited that you were the first one to to be able to do it. So thank you. Thank you, Abel, for, for showing us your collection. Welcome. Absolutely. Man, appreciate you having us today. Absolutely, man. And for everybody that that tuned in, we appreciate you for, for joining us today. Uh, make sure that you follow the page. We got a lot of dope content coming up right. here, in the near, here in the near future. Uh, yeah. And we got a lot of amazing gamers that's a part of our organization. So you guys make sure that you uh, follow the page. Uh, we will um, be doing some amazing things coming up. And we appreciate any subscriptions. Just to let you guys know that a per percentage of all prescrip uh, subscriptions, I said pres prescription, <laughs> a percentage of all subscriptions go to the goes toward the support of black owned business. Uh, so we really do appreciate that. But we appreciate you again, Abel. And I greatly thank you for coming in. Thank you, Asa. Thank you to the Chapman family. And for everybody out there, y'all know the vibes. Anytime your goals become the new standards, the only direction is up, baby. We up now. We up now, next up. Came up out that bottom, earned my stripes, became a stepper. Had to raise the ball. I had no idea like, all my friends were watching this. Had to show my hands. Oh, man, hey, well, you got 42 people watching you right now. What? Never the? 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 Never